Hey gang, I uh, just wanted to say hey, shout out out there because things are going fantastic. Um, an update you may not have, uh, I apologize, I started the video earlier and for some reason it all of a sudden just snapped off, so here I am back again uh, to give you some live update. It's Adam live on the beat, uh, getting ready to get out on the street. So what I have for you is an update regarding the ride. Okay, so the Wellspring Peloton Challenge ride that I'm a part of. And many of you know about already because I've just been basically hounding you with emails and posts here on Facebook. And thanks so much for uh, not disconnecting me. How's that? I really appreciate your uh, constant support and many people have chimed in. But many of you have also been great supporters of uh, donations to Wellspring. And I want to thank you for that. It means a lot to me. It means a lot to them, as you can imagine. Uh, they provide a fantastic service. If you don't know about it, please go to wellspring.ca, learn more about what their service offerings are for people that are living with cancer and their families and how they provide support. Uh, all that being said, uh, it's been a big fundraising drive so far. Uh, we're getting very close to uh, one milestone that's very important today. Uh, if you haven't heard about it through the emails, that's why I'm here to tell you now. Um, I could really use your support uh, with regards to fundraising to get us to a milestone of $8,000. What has happened is uh, I got notification yesterday that there's an anonymous donor that wanted to be uh, a strong contributor to the efforts I was putting forth to get you guys to support Wellspring, support me. And they said if I can get organically up to $8,000, they were going to donate another $1,000 to, um, to, to my pledge drive. So I need your help. We're at uh, $76.15 right now. So we're just shy of $400 that we need to get to. Um, but that being said, I really want to put a shout out today to some people that really made us uh, get over the top and get really close. And I want to thank um, Kathy Eaton, uh, Frank Zambosco, uh, Jennifer Galoop, uh, Hugh Sullivan. Um, thank you very much, Hugh. Uh, he came around a second time, actually. I, I can't thank him enough. Uh, my cousin, Larry Novakowski. Thank you very much, cuz. I uh, also like to thank Robert Kelly. Robert, uh, Bob and I have uh, worked with the Brian Smith ride for several years. Uh, so thanks, Bob, for coming in to help me out here. Uh, and also want to thank uh, Ann Osana. Now, Ann Osana is also doing her own. She joined up two days ago to come and join us on this ride. And she's doing the one day experience ride, 118 kilometers. And uh, she has a $500 drive she's trying to do for fundraising. And she's up to 400 already. So uh, you can maybe go help her out a little bit if you like as well. But thank you everybody for uh, pledging, coming in, helping out and uh, being a part of the, the whole excitement and the vibe. Um, but I don't, can't remember now if I said it in the beginning. We were supposed to go down to Miami, but obviously as we all know, um, it's, it's under a, a weather watch, weather warning, and uh, things are gonna be very challenging for them down there. So first off, my prayers out to, I have family down there, so my prayers out to you. Uh, I hope uh, you guys get through this safely and without too much harm, uh, both to yourselves and, and to the space around you. Um, but also because of that, uh, to keep the peloton safe and the riders, uh, you know, in, in, in a good place with regards to the fact just being on a bicycle, uh, we've changed the direction that we're going to go and we're going to Austin, Texas now. So that's an exciting change, but it's obviously been very nerve wracking, a lot of stuff going on to try to get all that coordinated. And uh, if anybody in the committee and, and organizers uh, behind the scenes are, are gonna be watching this, uh, please know from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much for your tireless hours in the past day and a half to try to get everything organized. Uh, big shout out to uh, Steve, uh, Christine, uh, Susan, uh, Billy, um, I, um, Cynthia, I know they've all been working tirelessly to make sure all the maps are correct now because we have to redirect uh, over to Austin and uh, you know we still have to avoid tornado weather but nonetheless I think it's going to be a lot safer direction to go uh, than down to Miami of course. So that's it for now. Uh, I will chime in again later and I'll let you know kind of where things stand uh, as we get closer. By the way, that challenge uh, to get up to 8,000 is by 9 p.m. So the goal was 8,000 by 9 p.m. 9 p.m. equals $9,000 because of the extra thousand that the anonymous donor was going to put in. So uh, I welcome your support. Please pass this around if you have some friends that know of Wellspring or have a place in their heart to want to support um, items that are cancer uh, related. Uh, with regards to support, research, that sort of thing, uh, then please pass this on because this is not selective just to the people that I know. Uh, this can go out to anybody uh, and, and that support would be welcome, greatly welcomed. Okay, so thanks again. 
uh, and I'll talk to you close to nine o'clock because I'm probably going to come back online because I'm going to be all excited and jacked up to, to let you know how things are going and if, if we made it. Okay, ciao. Turn this off. How do I turn it off? <laughs>